leaving Phantom Ranch, third day in the bottom of the canyon. Well, it's October 5th, 2023. We started at 4.50 in the morning. Started walking. Just kind of got away from the Colorado River right now. And it's about 10 till 6. I think sunrise is 6.15. Supposed to be 87 degrees today down at the bottom by Phantom Ranch. That's where we camped last night, so we wanted to kind of beat the heat. It's a little over 9 miles to the south rim. Okay, you guys really can't see nothing. I'll wait till daylight to record. Well, it's getting light. We came from down there. I don't know if you can see all the switchbacks or not. There's Ice Man. A lot of switchbacks, so it's not real steep. There's Chrome Blind. And switchback all the way up to here. And I suppose there'd be switchbacks all the way up that way. Just another look at all the switchbacks. We came from like around in there. I mean, when you look down to South Rim, there's no way you can see the bottom. We got so many valleys and up so many draws. Uh, we think when we get to Indian Garden, you might be able to see the South Rim. Like right now, you can't even see the Colorado River. And it does seem to be a pretty gradual incline. But we got 4,250 feet, I think, to the south rim of vertical climb. Um, 9 o'clock or 8 o'clock, I think. 6.30 or so. Oh, we got time. Old Mac. Ice Man and Old Mac. Little video of all the switchbacks. I think you can see a trail way down in there. That's the way we're going. Up in through there. Probably around up through there. I think I still see trail. Oh, yeah. Here's Ice Man. Taking in the view. Whoop, fingers in the way. There's the switchbacks. That's what the trail looks like. We only got nine miles of that to the south rim. Here's the trail through here. Like I can't say, we can't even begin to see the top. Just keep going up these valleys and maybe Indian Gardens, we can see the top. Right, right against the wall here. But that's where we came from. We've been going up this little wet trail for a little while. I got one wet foot. I thought I was eating a stinger. 
didn't have my poles out. So now I got one wet foot for the rest of rest of the trip. Oh, you know. Okay. I think we done a little over three miles in two hours. It's nine miles to the south wind. Been a nice cool breeze uh, all the way up the canyon. Making it really doable. It's about 7.30. Still heading up, and then the sun's gonna catch up to us sooner or later. Gonna get over the canyon wall, be honest. But as we go up in elevation, I think the temperature would be a little cooler. I just thought that looked neat. I better zoom in on it. South Rim, four and a half miles. So I think I've went four and a half miles already. And there's the bathrooms up there. And the temperature says about 59 degrees right there. I still got uh, one water bottle and a little bit left, but I think I'll get some more water up here. Here we are in the Inn Gardens. This is Indian Gardens. Yeah. <laughs> Four and a half miles to go. About seven hours, eight hours. <laughs> what time is it, old Mac? 7.45. 7.45 and we started about 4.50. I think everybody's doing good. They had a thermometer there and it was uh, 59 degrees. Been a cool breeze all morning. That's helped. Sun shining down there in the valley. Trail winds around a little bit. Hasn't been real steep. Still got steep walls all around us. And we're going up that way. It just looks like we're in a box canyon. We keep going up into it. It's like, how are we ever gonna get out of this? Bunch of switchbacks. That's where I'm coming from. Go around here, up here. Just keep going back and forth. Somewhere up there we'll get over to that peak, I guess. That's where we came from. Getting out of that box canyon. Wind all around a bunch of switchbacks. We're getting near the top. I think we get to the top, we'll be three miles from the south rim. I think up there's a little rest stop. Maybe water. We made it to the three mile rest. One more YouTube left to see if we make it out of the Grand Canyon.